Normanton Road is a vibrant street and vibrant part of the city. It's a melting pot of cultures, of tastes. Of... I think the Normanton Road is it, it, uh, brilliant. Uh, they get the brilliant people on Normanton Road. The place, obviously, a little bit deprived compared to some areas of Derby. I've been walking through here my whole life, basically. What impression do you think people have of Normanton? Uh, it's difficult, it's a bit dingy, people may think. If you go down one street and there's a mattress outside, it can have a massive effect on the people that live in the surrounding areas. My name's Adam and I'm a community organiser for Derbyshire Wildlife Trust on the Next Door Nature initiative. Next Door Nature is all about bringing communities together to create a greener Derby city. For the past year, I've been working with the Pakistan Community Centre. We've created apple bird feeders, made nature-based art together, and it's been really great to see the children take a keen interest in the natural world around them. I was so excited to hear that the Pakistan Community Centre were having the theme of environment for this summer half programme. And I thought it would be great if they could make a change to their environment in Normanton. Pakistan Community Centre, myself and a local youth worker, Ruth Richardson, created an art competition which will feed into the designs of the mural on the Normanton Road Hanging Gardens. The children had some really great ideas and it was amazing to see their, their creativity. Uh, so, my name's Todd, a professional artist. I do art in quite a lot of different mediums. The current project is all using spray paint. Yeah, I live in Normanton. Yeah, I mean, I think Normanton's the most interesting bit of Derby, really, to be honest. Like, um, there's always stuff going on here. Yeah, it's got a bit of life to it. A lot of other areas in Derby just don't have the same sort of vibrance. Like, a lot of high streets these days just all look the same. Like, it's the same companies, like, same, you know, just in a different order on the high street. Whereas Normanton's got a lot more, like, uh, individuals, which is cool. This area's always looked, as long as I've been here, pretty pretty bad really so it's been good to give a bit back and kind of yeah brighten it up I guess yeah the kids came up with some good ideas so we got um it's always good to have a, a starting point for a mural so we get some ideas like uh hit the ground running get some sort of uh, the basis for the ideas uh, some of the, the the trees and the nature sort of aspect to it is it's quite fun to paint and um it's been quite loose so I've been able to kind of creatively put a little bit of input into it, which has been quite um, quite fun. Uh, the preparation is probably in a bit I enjoy the least. <laughs> yeah, we've been chatting to a lot of people while we've been spray painting and um, doing the mural, and everyone's had a really positive response to what we've been doing. Well. These areas that haven't seen much attention in a long time, I think it's a positive thing to, to get them sort of looking a little bit better for the community. I think like um, I think maybe uh, it could be quite a vibrant place. Could maybe bring some more people in, sort of bring more money to the local businesses. That part of Normanton Road was really dull. Uh, overgrown, looked very neglected. So having all that colour and vibrancy there, right, you know, in the centre of Normanton on the centre of Normanton Road, um, is a great addition to the area. Okay, it's all been a rubbish tip, and just to walk down here, and the area looks so bright. It really, really makes the area stand out. But just to see something like this, it makes a lot like the community is all coming together. Fantastic, I think it's good that we've got kids involved, try to keep it within the community. Hopefully it brightens it up and it might make people think differently about trying to take care of the areas that they live in.
looks much better. It's brightening up the community. I walk past this every day and it just looks a bit dull and down. And to see it today on my way home from work, honestly, it just looks so much better. And just bright, it gives you, you know, just positive hopes, it gives you a smile.